Good morning, Wolf Kang. Uh, start of a new day. The dogs had a nice little bath and she is salivating. That's not your bowl, your bowl's over there. Go. This is Kira's. So whoever in the comments suggested honey, that has worked to a T for Kira. She stopped. <laughs> um, I think like literally only in the mornings now but I've been giving her, I've given her a tablespoon about twice a day, and Kira loves it, and she goes crazy, and it's been helping with her throat and stuff, so, which is a good thing. Here, Kira, here. Was it good? <laughs> Uh-oh, some more basketball news. Today's the second round picks, right? Mm-hmm. Pain, man. I feel brawny though, man, because I don't know if any of you guys watch basketball or watched that, but uh, dang, where's the, oh. I don't know if any of you guys watched basketball or watched the uh, the draft, but unfortunately, brawny wasn't drafted on the first round. Hey, this is Kira. Whoever commented, honey, shout out to you, bro. I appreciate it. Look how excited Yumi is. Ah, ah, ah. No, you gotta be gentle. No. Gentle, go ahead, gently though. That's why she has like a slow feeder, cause she just, that dog man, she goes in on my ass. And she'll go to town the minute any food touches the floor. So. Anyways guys, good morning, start of a new day. Somebody uh, placed the order, I'm really surprised because we're already running low. Well, we don't really have much, but got another random order that we gotta go drop this off and deliver. I'm on 14 days, 15 hours and six minutes. It has been two weeks officially as of today since I stopped smoking. You guys can do it too, man. You can do whatever your goal is, whatever you set out to do, and whatever you want to accomplish, you can do it, man. This is one of those things. It's been over half, it's been a, yeah, a little bit over two weeks now, half a month, deep, no smoke. I'm not gonna lie, it's not easy, bro. It's been rough, it's been rough. Not easy, it's been rough, but it's been worth it, so. Um, we gotta deliver this package. We got a random order last night for more 715, so. Got to go deliver, drop this off at the post office. Before we go do that, a lot of you guys been saying, you know, we know it's Val behind the camera and all these things, and I don't know. I guess you guys caught you caught the skit, man. You got us and shit. It's over with, you know. Damn, they got you, so Damn. I'm revealing Val. Unfortunately, Val, you gotta. Uh, Oh my gosh. My name's not even Val. <laughs> what? I'm just messing with you guys. No, yeah. she's literally not here, so. Oh, it's just me and these guys. Did you eat all your food that fast? We're not even done with the intro. You already ate all your... All right, we gotta go. Let's go. Okay. Man, it is hot. <laughs> I'm scared to go back home to Arizona, bro. I know if we go back to AZ, it's gonna be cooking. <laughs> you ready to go back there? You wanna go check out AZ? It'll be way too hot. I think it'll be like 110, 115. I, I do have plans to go um, ATVing, off-roading. I think it, that'd be kind of cool, no? Yeah. For the vlog and stuff. Uh, anyways, I wanted to, I did not know you had leg tattoos. I don't, have you ever shown anybody any of your tattoos? I show all my friends my tattoos, but never. But you've never shown it like on video before? I don't think we, so. Go right here, there's a nice solid light here. Let's uh, I wanna show them, bro, you have, you have actual ink, man. Yeah. And it's like, uh, it's dope, man, it's anime. Start with my hand, Black Bulls. I don't know if you guys watch anime, but it's from Black Clover. We got Asa Zero, um, Zeno from, um, this is the actual bird that she turns into. I got all Looney Tunes on this side. Got a uh, Road Runner. Get more there? Yeah, I'm just trying to figure out. I got Pokey the Pig. These look old though. Yeah, these are old. This is about like five years old. 
Oh, okay. So you've had those three. For a yeah, Bugs Bunny, Porky the Pig, Tom and Jerry, and then for the oldies, I got the Mighty Mouse. <laughs> Damn. Yeah. Okay. What else you got? I got uh, Ratalia from um, Rising of the Shield Hero, and then I got Anime is Life, and Life is a, is in Japanese. So if you guys know how to read Japanese, you okay, know. Okay. What else do you have? And then I keep forgetting her name. That's one of the sisters from Demon Slayer. Oh, okay. Yeah. And then that's it. I will say those are all my tattoos. Would you ever do like the the chest area, like up here? Maybe. I just have to get a body like that first. <laughs> I wanna. What I wanna, about what about like what's an area you would never touch? My neck and my face. Neck and face. Yep. Never. But you would do your back and everything. Yeah, cause. Are I, you planning I, on getting a full sleeve for the? Uh, yeah. It's all good, dude. Yeah. When I got my hands done, I was like, you know what? It is what it is, bro. Yeah. They could cover it up if they really want me. I'm good. I'm good. I, there was no turning back. Once you get your hand tattooed, that's kind of it, man. Yeah. It's going to be tough. A little tough to get a nine to five. Bro, I remember I worked at... Let me tell you guys a little thing about tattoos and... Uh, and work. <laughs> when I... Well, first first came to LA and I was trying to get a uh, and I was trying to get a, a job they looked at tattoos and was like mm -mm. <laughs> and it was it wasn't like the craziest job I wanted to be uh, a waiter and they were like nah you can't do it I'm like damn that's that sucks because of the tattoos and it, my tattoos used to stop like right here I, I don't know um, but you know, I've doing YouTube throughout the years. I was like, you know what? I'm gonna full send it and just went hands and entrepreneur lifestyle, bro. <laughs> so, anyways, the hands kind of hurt, kind of. The chest almost feels like you can't breathe because you're sitting there for hours while they're. Brrr. And then, the worst one to me has been the ribs. I've never got my legs tattooed. I've thought about it. Make sure you love your tattoos because. I think they're cool. You know what's crazy? Like, 70% of the world doesn't have ink on them. Yeah. That's crazy. Like, you look around, a lot of people just don't have tattoos. Um, maybe, like, little baby ones, but to, like, you know, go all crazy like that. Once you get ink, bro, you're going to want to get more and more ink. <laughs> but a like, lot of people don't have ink. I got my aunt to get tattoos, and now her whole arm is full of tattoos now. For real? Yeah. I love tattoos. I think, especially if you're like an artsy person, a lot of artsy people like have tattoos. Um, they're cool. I just, you know, I advise anybody that wants to get one, make sure that it's something that means a lot to you and it's going to be with you for the rest of your life. Like, I get it, bro. I do get it. Because that's a lot of like nostalgia on your arm and that's stuff that you, you know, you grew up with. So that's cool. Um, I got a Pikachu. <laughs> It's a matching one that I have with Val. I got like I got some dumb ones like Cause. I thought that um, Cause is a really dope artist. Um, it's cool, man. I get it. You know, I got I got a. Uh, you know what? All tattoos are dumb. <laughs> Why do we need a clock as a reminder? This one I got because it was like a reminder to myself that you know, every make every minute count type of thing. You know, until. Cause you'll die one day and once that clock runs out that's it man if you didn't do what you had to do that's on you mm -hmm. <laughs> so grind and make make happen what you want to make happen uh anyways we're going to the post office we're going to drop off this one package i low-key almost forgot we still had inventory left on that but someone placed the order um i think there's literally like one of each hoodie and it's like an XL or something and then uh, I don't know you guys can go to the site down below it's uh, wolfgangent.co go to the site down below and you guys could see whatever's left on inventory it's like literally slim pickings in there I'm telling you it's like I don't I have like less than half a container left in there <laughs> so maybe one of these days we'll go to an event and we'll just give away merch I don't know but um, or maybe you guys have a cool idea. I, I don't want to do like giveaways or any of that stuff because a lot of you guys think it's cap or whatever, but it's not cap. I don't know. When I literally 
showed us mailing off and people even made videos receiving the is this this is the post office right mm. or am i tripping uh, I, I think so i don't know i think that's the courthouse that's the courthouse i think so ah oh, shit we gotta put it in here where do you want to go usps sorry i can't show the result to you while you're in the car <laughs> Where do you want to go? United States Postal Service. One option is U.S. Post Office on East Broadway in yeah, Glendale. Yeah, you passed it. It's behind you. That was the city hall. Oh. oh. Everybody has one dumb tattoo. Do you have one dumb tattoo that you regret? Um. Do you regret? I feel like, I feel like, no, no, I don't have any dumb regret sometimes i think this hand is is dumb to did but i still love it match 100 percent because the career that i'm trying to get into but other than that not really because this all is like family based so like when i was growing up i used to watch looney like my mom used to put on looney tunes every morning when i was growing up so that's the kind of reason why mighty mouse my mom calls me mighty mouse a lot so it was like it gave me that 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 self-love like i love my mom no matter what yeah. so and then I'm a huge anime nerd, so of course I have to get anime. See, that's the thing too. Like tattoos have really, really deep meanings. You know, like that mean a lot to that specific person. Like I, me, I would never get a Mighty Max tattoo, but you, it makes sense because that's you know something that you had with your family. Mm -hmm. You know, like you would never get a spray can with his face on it. <laughs> no. <laughs> if I look dumb, but to me it means a lot. Like a wolf. Wolfgang tattoo. You know, I've seen people that got Wolfgang tattoos, like legit Wolfgang tattoos, whether it was like this, like the, the full face of the logo, or um, bro, some of you guys have sent me some crazy, crazy ones. Uh, one of you guys have a quote the entire if you woke up today, you already got the W quote on your forearm. Um, you guys have sent me some pretty wicked tattoos which is crazy bro if you guys have tattoos some wolfgang tattoos send it to me bro it's always crazy it just blows my mind to see that you guys am i tripping or did i you pass it going, again keep going straight that's crazy though bro shout out to any of you guys that have ever gotten a wolfgang tattoo you know what i would get that's random like cartoon wise i would get rocket power oh rocket power that's, rocket power that, means that was, that so was much the show in terms of stuff that means a lot to my childhood rocket power was like I used to watch that every morning. It was that SpongeBob and see that's sad. Why the Doug. funniest thing? Why I didn't? I don't have a SpongeBob tattoo. You that should be your next tattoo. Get a SpongeBob tattoo <laughs> of him going like this. Yeah. <laughs> I would get, if I was to get a SpongeBob tattoo, I'd get a Glove World SpongeBob. Oh. Where he's holding the glove. Oh, either know. that or him and Bubble Buddy would be sick. I don't know. Bubble Buddy would be pretty dope. <laughs> All right. Found it. Finally found it. This looks like the entrance to Ghostbusters. Ooh. Hopefully there's not a big line here. I think it's just Like a Always a good time, man. This looks like old school bank. Look at that. Okay, that's fine. Can I see the address on the package? To make, just to make sure, real quick. Oh, yep, looks good. Stay here. Cool, nice thank you. Have a good one. Appreciate it. Yeah, I could have sworn they filmed Ghostbusters here. Oh. Look at this. Look at this. Tell me. There you go, it's down there. Some bodies <laughs> underground somewhere here. <laughs> I know the librarian's downstairs somewhere. <laughs> Alright. Now, you're going to hate me, but we got a 30 minute drive. <laughs> we're at, we're back over here at off the You would think I, you would think I'm part owner of this place by this point, huh? 
wonder how many square feet exactly it is, but it is massive. Um, don't forget, I'm just making a quick stop here, but don't forget on the 30th, uh, they're going to be doing a, uh, how's it going? All of, all of this will be free. So from the trampoline to bumper cars to uh, the skywalk up there, this is all brand new. So make sure you pull up on the 30th. It should be a good time. If you live out here in LA, anywhere in like Southern California, even if you're from San Diego, you can pull up here. They got this massive trampoline park that they just built. They said it took them three days to build this. It was like three or four people that built this entire trampoline park. This place is massive. Though. All you gotta say is jump 30 and uh, they'll let you in here free. Obviously the arcade isn't gonna be free. You have to buy tickets if you wanna play in the arcade, but if you wanna try and beat my, my record climbing up this thing, it'll be free. Random fact. I used to be in the news, I was in a newspaper article for being super fast at climbing up rock walls. That was when I was like 16, 17 ish. I had a nickname Spider Man because I would climb up to the top. I could literally sit at the top of any rock wall and then I would jump off it and go upside down. If you dig deep in the Arizona Republic uh, archive somewhere, you type my real name in, you'll see a picture of me hanging upside down. <laughs> Probably in black and white. I'll be upside down like this. <laughs> they have food. They have prizes. So if you get hungry while you're playing around, which you're gonna get hungry, uh, come in here and grab some food. Another cool thing is in the future, if you guys have birthday parties or anything like that, you can book yourself a room and have your own private lounge. You can book your own private lounge and uh, host your own birthday party here, so which is cool. On June 30th, use code JUMP30. It's called Off the Wall Game Zone. Win some prizes, have fun, and try and beat me on the rock wall. <laughs> Damn, that's, that's tough. Hold on. Let me do it one more time. Oh, come on. All right, get a close shot of that. Come on, man. I know I can do this. Come on! All right, one more, one more. This thing's gonna eat up all my tokens. Oh my gosh! Okay, one more, one more. Oh my god! Am I tripping? <laughs> oh my gosh! I'm so close. Hang on, dude. I don't know what else. I do. I just wanted to win it to win it. I didn't really want to win it. I just. <laughs> you should just give it to a little girl. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Nah. I, uh, if you pull up on the 30th, I'm just gonna give this away to somebody. Just use Chino 30. Say Chino 30, and the first person that says Chino 30 at the door, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have them just give you this or whatever. They got some other, come here, they have some other cool stuffed animals. Uh, they got a ninja hamster, uh, a, a dog, they got a, a giant penguin. Say Chino 30 at the door. Only one person though. If you say Chino 30 when you walk through that door, uh, get this one or one of these other stuffed animals and I'll hook you up. June 30th. Pull up. If you're in LA, if you're in Southern California, pull up. It's gonna be free, it's gonna be fun. Man, I can't believe it's already four o'clock now, man. I am starving and it's hot. I can see the sweat coming. <laughs> it's time to go eat, man. I am ready to chow down. You got your chocolate milk? I was happy, yo. When they said, pick anything that you want, I was look, I was thinking about water or soda, but then I saw the Nesquik and I was like, yes. 
you need to get a brand deal with Nesquik, man. What's, what, what is the big thing with you and chocolate milk? Why do you love chocolate milk? So oh, it's just my, it's my coffee. It's like your coffee? Yeah. I feel it. I feel it. I was just curious what, like, I don't know, everybody has their thing, man. I got this new thing where I'm on to yogurt. I feel like everybody has that, that one thing that they just love, bro, for some weird reason. Like, I used to really, it was probably really bad, though, but uh, I used to really have a bad habit of every day I would eat a brownie. It's probably not the best thing to do, but I right. was heavily into brownies. Like cooked brownies or like your own brownies or like store brownies? Just any brown. I don't care matter where I was. I just knew I had to have a brownie. So those days are long gone, man. Because I realized I was eating way too much chocolate and um, I started getting pimples all over. It was bad, bro. <laughs> no more brown. Well, I mean, every once in a blue moon after a solid meal, I'll give me a nice brownie. When I was doing grub runs with your that's when that, that craving kind of came back and yeah now i'm on to yogurt i don't know if it's a good or a bad thing i'm starting to learn a little bit more about yogurts i kind of mess with parfaits acai bowls um that's, that stuff is really good man <laughs> there is a lot of people parked here at this mall i did not think it would be this pack i can't find parking to save my life let me ask you a question let me ask you this elijah mm -hmm. if you any car right any car you could or matter of fact it doesn't even have to be in this parking lot if you had the choice of getting your ex what is your dream car my dream car is a mustang what is your dream car let me know in the comments what your dream car is Lexi let me know the answer to this question if you if you you want a mustang yeah. out of all the cars in the world mm -hmm. you don't want a Lamborghini no. Bugatti I want a 1950 uh, oh, GT Fastback uh, Mustang, so 1950. That's like my retirement chilling out car. But like, if I wanted to like take to a racetrack, I would say one of the brand new Mustang. Okay, so say you were able to get that Mustang, right? Mm -hmm. That's your dream car. And you, you can get your dream car. Your dream car plus 50 grand in your pocket right now or $300,000. This, is, this I, is before taxes, so you still have to pay taxes on the 300,000 and you or you'd have to pay taxes on the car. But I'll give you enough money to cover the taxes on the car. Which one are you getting? Uh, 300 see. cash or the keys to your dream car plus fifty thousand. Because then, if you take the three hundred cash, you can just buy your dream car. You could, or once I mean, once you have the money in your hand, you're probably gonna want to do some other stuff. No, probably get a house instead. First, the first thing I would actually do is get my dream car. Because that thing is only like sixty thousand. But or you could just have your dream car, and I'll give you fifty grand on top of it, cover your taxes. How much is that car worth? Like the brand new one. Yeah. Like sixty-five, if you customize it yourself. Okay, so I'll give you, so I'll give you one hundred twenty thousand cash, or your your dream car. One hundred twenty thousand dollars, or your dream car plus fifty k. I would say my dream car and the fifty k. You don't know my answer. What? I would get a R thirty four, right? Nineteen ninety eight or nineteen ninety nine. Nissan GTR, uh, right side drive. That would be my dream car or cash. And let's say they were gonna give me 250 cash. Taking the cash. F that car. <laughs> okay. Here's my reasoning behind why I say screw the dream car. I take. Let's say, all right, watch out. I don't want you to get hit. <laughs> Let's say they were gonna give me $200,000 cash for that Nissan GTR, taking a $200,000 cash. Big brain plays, go invest that money into something. And then later down the road, go get whatever car you want. Cars depreciate businesses well they could technically depreciate but it's on you so the success is dependent upon you 
I'm going, I'm gonna go start a business. Even 50,000, you can go start a business, you know what I mean? But man, it's been a minute since we've been in here, bro. What are you in the mood for? You want Panda Express? Yes. Really? Yes. I was just joking, but all right. <laughs> Panda Express? Yeah, sorry, I can it. Wanna Let's get this instead of hand. You just sold it. Okay, okay. <laughs> what was that she just gave me? I don't know why I have this weird thing about like putting my card into something. I'd rather tap. I don't know if anybody else is like that, but I don't like, uh, especially when you're in drive throughs when you hand your card over to somebody. So imagine you're in a drive thru So they'll have their phone set up like that, and when you're in a drive thru and you hand them your card, they'll show, they'll show it like this, front and back, on a, and they're hitting record, and then they hand you your card back to your drive thru It takes like two seconds, and then all your info is gone, bro. That's why yeah. I'm very skeptical about handing out my card to anybody or putting it in something. There's even the, the videos of the uh, people inside of a gas station. The gas station, they like change the, they have like a uh, scanner, skimmer, mm -hmm. where they can skim your car and they put it on top of the reader. Mm -hmm. So even tapping is still kind of iffy. So I don't know, just be careful out there guys. There's a lot of there's, there's scams. Even fake, um Fake card readers too. Yeah, fake card readers when you're at the gas station, bro. It's, just, it's all bad. Oh man. History was just made today, guys. Ronnie James just signed to the Lakers. These are like the last Ray, one. Ray Band esque. Me and sunglasses don't get along, bro. Every, that's why I hate buying them. Every time I buy them, I lose them. <laughs> Unfortunately, that happens when I lose them sunglasses. It's like the bang. That is the world for me, man. That's why you only pay $20 for sunglasses. Because if you lose them, you don't have to worry about spending yeah, $500 on another pair of glasses. Although, I tend to think if you spend that kind of money on sunglasses, all of a sudden you feel this incentive need to try and keep them. That's what I thought. I have to, at minimum, be at least $1,500 deep in sunglasses. Uh -huh. That's within this year. Well, what kind of style were the first ones you had? No, those kind of remind me of... Sailboro? Actually, if you sign up with our VIP membership rewards program, yes, you get 20% off that top. Is it specific brands or anything? There are specific brands, but that is one of the ones you can get. That's a lot of sunglasses, man. I, like, I really like the Pradas. Let me see. Just because my, my glasses are Prada, I might as well just keep it Prada, man. Try those ones on and go right there. This one? I did. Okay. I tried those on. I like those. I was gonna say, I gotta be honest, those are one of my personal favorites from the Prada line right now. They're a lot like these ones, which everybody has. This yeah. is a top seller for sure. I like this, like the badge, oh, but okay. I don't like the shape. Yes, yeah. Very... They, they usually do that badge for the more fashion. The shape? Oh, thicker. Like longer. Mm hmm. Oh, these are hard. 517. These are the best looking ones? So far, yes. Out of those that you had on, those looks a little bit better. These ones are like huge. Got one more thing to try too. Versace. Bold on the sides, similar shape. Not a fan side. of Versace, man. I had a pair. I ended up just giving them away for free because I didn't like them. What What took you off of them? Uh, it was the like it was the uh, the biggie ones. Oh, okay. You gotcha. know what I'm talking about? The, yeah. the, the big. That's another the, one of those top sellers, but you gotta be into like really loud ass. Yeah, ones. really so loud. I just like black, man. Just yeah. clean black. Try some more stuff on. I'm gonna check back in a minute. I just wanna make sure I can the other folks. Alright, for sure. What was your name, by the way, Chino. Mason. Nice. 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 Damn near broke my wrist. <laughs> Kinda rocking with these, man. Do they look a little girly looking? What do you think? Mm. No or what? I would say not those. The other ones that you had on was better. I still want to go check out the Balenciaga sunglasses. I wanted to get some like these. I like how like they're thin looking. Been meaning to get new sunglasses because I lost my last ones while we were on a trip. But I like these, 
I just don't like this. I wouldn't mind. I just like how like the, the shape of them is like thin. If they have it in all black, like how the sides of these ones are, these are way too thick. Yeah, no. <laughs> I do. I like these. These are hard. I would definitely pop these. Those are too big of a shoes. Like, what is this? Those are boots. Big boots. These are 41s? Damn, now it's tight. Believe it or not, these are small. See the difference? <laughs> Do you see the difference? <laughs> It's crazy. Uh, the only black on black we have is gonna be the one with like the cat eye kind of thing. I just looked at that one. I wasn't a fan of it. Yeah, it's a little too aggressive, I think. Yeah. Like I feel like I just like the thin shape of these. Yeah. But I seen it not too long ago where it was like. Cause I think I have black and gold of these in the back without the stones in it. Almost got suckered into impulse buying some sunglasses. <laughs> I really, really, really want to get sunglasses, but. It was a W salesman, man. He made me his friend and chopped it up and talked about all kinds of shit. Almost got my bitch ass into <laughs> buying some sunglasses. I almost. This close. Not gonna lie, these bitches hard, bro. They is crazy, dude. <laughs> these bitches loud as hell. These bitches hard. Hey, man. What's good? It's popping, man. You know, uh, it's been two weeks now. No smoke. That's why you all moving around, clapping yeah, your hands. Yeah, I'm, up, <laughs> I'm over here like this, you know? Hyper I don't know what's wrong with me. Anyways, what y'all been on? Nah, I'm chilling. I finally got some snacks for you. I, I leave grab a box of snacks for you in just in case you come over here. Because you could play the last time you were here. Yeah, y'all didn't have nothing. Where move <laughs> at? Up oh. Uh, yeah, bro. Just been chilling. I got this new thing where I've uh, been eating yogurt. I don't go on dates. I sit my ass in the house. <laughs> oh, you done with the dates? Yeah, okay. You ain't called me and give me no updates on uh, on nothing after the date. Like, did you get in trouble? Or? I don't know. I think so. I'm not doing that ever again, though. I don't know why we did that. I don't know yeah, what why. What do you mean? You said we should do it. I don't know what was going on that day. I was different behind. <laughs> but once we got there, I'm like, snowboards? Like, I gotta get out of here. <laughs> It's not my fault. It's Vaughn's fault. Blame Vaughn. Don't on me. It's Vaughn's fault. I ain't calling nobody. <laughs> you know what you should do? <laughs> so, um, you said you ain't you ain't like had no cigarettes or you still doing vapes? Like you ain't smoked anything? I smoke vapes, but like zero okay. percent nick. All right, good then. Like nothing. It tastes like this. If you were to boil it down in the water. I had a vape like that before. It was like, it had flavors. So I had strawberry, kiwi, all types. That shit was good as hell. But it just didn't, didn't do nothing. Like, it's like, not, like you get mad. Like, you keep blowing it. I Man, never want to. pissing me off. I need something to make me lay down. Fuck that. <laughs> Quite, let me ask you this question. I asked this question earlier. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Let me ask you something. I know you try to look Spanish. He Filipino, y'all. Out of all the chips in that whole box. Mm -hmm. They got all them delicious flavors on the box. Mm -hmm. You telling me you grab Fritos? Yeah. Yeah. You, you still want me to stand here and talk to you? <laughs> Damn. This shit. For anybody else in the world buy this shit? I know you're sick as hell. <laughs> that bitch did not look like commercial. <laughs> commercial made it look like you was in the future, boy. This don't even work. I don't know how you work on. I've been trying. I wanted to see how it works. Do this is some bullshit. It's probably be careful. Yeah, when you put them on, you start looking like a whole nother person. Like you hunting for somebody. Oh, oh yeah, this is predator. This is <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? This is some bullshit. If you bought, spent, how much is this? Like two, three? It's like, like four. Rack. Four racks? I think it's like four racks. Is it three? I'm just <laughs> Most expensive phone you can get. <laughs> I mean, the last time y'all see me here. What's this? What's the kind of freaky shit is going on right here? You testing, you grow. Kind of freaky stuff. You a dog man, so you ain't never really been around no cats, huh? Nah, I'm I'm good off. I like cats. cats. They, that, they the shit. So this cat never scratched you or anything? No. I had a cat do weird shit like that though. Some of them do do stuff like that, but it's funny. What if a uh, cat ain't really gonna hurt you unless if you scared of them. Like, well, I really don't even know how a cat would hurt you though. Like, if that little motherfucker try to attack me, come on. 
I'm a grown man. <laughs> what you gonna do to me? What if a girl came up to you like a cat did and started rubbing their face? <laughs> <laughs> I have had that done, Ooh, but that. it was just something totally. No, don't do that. That's not family friendly. Oh, okay. Oh, you know, I ain't got that. It might make you want a cigarette or something. I don't know. It looks white as shit. I don't even raw, It might look like cigarettes in there. You been a smoke right now? Yeah, I, I'm still a smoker, mother. I ain't give up my dream. <laughs> I'm gonna be the most smoked out human. <laughs> what you talking about? Just hit it, man. Yeah, no. I like cigarettes. I'm not gonna pick no tobacco. This is straight the, the fresh stuff, okay? You hit that? I hit that, I start turning into a That's what you need. A right real now. Asian, bro. You'll see Jet Lee standing here and shit. I'll start morphing and shit. Out on the court turn into Dermy Lane and shit. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm not hitting that shit. You ain't been smoking no cigarettes. Mm -mm. So this is let Lee be perfect for you because it's gonna ease your it gonna leave. It gonna drain all the cigarette tobacco out of you. No. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. I hit that bitch. I'm gonna turn into Jackie Chan. I'll start doing backflips in here for some reason. I start drooling. I you swear to God, I look at you like this. Uh, you start drooling in front of me. I'm gonna leave. Start swollen. <laughs> <laughs> I'm good. I actually got you something to drink to go with your chips since you eating weird shit. Fritos. <laughs> you would eat anything if you would eat some Fritos. So don't <laughs> even drink that with it. Carrot, apple, mango. Baby, be really eat. You ever taste one of those? You drank one of them? I have a kid. When you got a kid, you just drink you this. You're like, man, I ain't finna keep giving my kid this without tasting. Let me taste. You it. ate baby food? Uh, yeah, I taste all my daughter food. You see what it tastes like? I ain't finna just put nothing in her mouth without <laughs> knowing what it tastes like. Bro, baby food is so nasty. This shit is so disgusting. Baby food is like uh, smoothies for adults. Like if you can't, let's say you had a broken jaw and you can't eat a hamburger. You grind a hamburger down into <laughs> a smoothie. That's what that's what baby food tastes like to me. That's nasty, bro. I never feed my kid that. You know what my, feed, my kid's gonna eat? The kid is in your balls. Punching that bitch. Let me out! <laughs> let me out! You can't let time keep passing and not have the kid already, man. You gotta get to work. You over here want to smoke and shit. <laughs> Fuck that bullshit. You want to smoke. I got my kid. I did my job. <laughs> I'm trying, man. I think I'm just blowing dust at this point. No, ain't nobody blowing dust. You gonna my raise nuts, at least one nigga in that probably look just like this. <laughs> <laughs> Should be black. Oh, oh yeah, just blow it out. <laughs> He don't eat nothing. Shit, come out like blue. <laughs> <laughs> I'm shooting soy sauce blanks. Uh, he Ronnie, got dropped. Ronnie, it. Ronnie has it made, bro. It's good. He's good. Yeah, it don't matter. If it Ronnie... don't matter if he's ass right now because give it, give give Ronnie two years in the in the NBA. He gonna be some kind of Look, dog, man. bro. Like, hey, Ronnie, wish. you come across this clip and shit, bro. I want you to know from Big Unk Bond and shit. First, send me some cash since you just got that new pocket. Um, also, you can make it, man. You ain't got to do shit. You can average 1.1 .1 points. You just make sure you get on that court and you assess it to LeBron. Or when he passed to you, you just got to make a layup. One day. It don't even have to have. You could go 82 games missing the layup. You finally make that bitch. You done made history. I done score with my daddy on the court. Nigga, that's the best thing. It's already made history. It's the first... Father yes. son duo. Ain't nobody just doing that in no history. You bro. can't hate on it. I don't bro. care what nobody say. Uh, uh, it don't matter, bro. You can't hate. You can't they do hate that in baseball, though. You yeah. did you know that? Can't baseball, a couple motherfuckers did that. Dude. First time ever in the NBA, though. Yeah, NBA, no, I think there was other teams that, but it was like 19 something that they had father and son. No, no this is literally the first father son duo in NBA history. That matters, shit. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't smoked in like two weeks. Bro. Not one cigarette. It's good. Yeah. Kinda. Turn into a crackhead now. Bro. I'm eating all kinds of weird, weird shit I never thought I'd eat. What you eat? Tofu and yogurt. A lot of yogurt. Really? Something wrong with me, bro. <laughs> Been shitting out yogurt for the past two weeks. You're farting and shit. No, I'm just like stomach feels like marshmallows and shit, bro. I just I don't feel right. right. Type shit. How was Paris? Lit. Yeah? You speak, uh, what's the language out there? My <laughs> Jewish You want to hit this blunt No, don't smoke no weed. I literally just told him I'm, I haven't smoked. Right, 
Is that the one with heroin in it? <laughs> but, you know, the last time I smoked, uh, smoked that was in 2019, really, 2020, but, bro, I smoked myself retarded, bro, I smoked, <laughs> actually, no, it was here, you guys had me working out and shit, and I couldn't function at all, bro, them weights felt like, like, I couldn't, like all of the, all the energy in my body was gone. No, man, why are you purposely blowing it over here? Stop. You know you want to hit that bitch. <laughs> no, I don't want to hit that bitch. <laughs> you wanna... know you want to. Can I hit my vape though? I got like 5% yeah, cool. nicotine. Yeah, that's cool, I got vape too. But this 5% nicotine, I want to. That little 5% might hit you. No. <laughs> Cigarettes! <laughs> right to the car. Zoom! What? What the fuck? <laughs> don't smoke around this guy. <laughs> what is that? Yo, look at that boy. He's got an electric shitter for the cat. What the fuck? So you make too much bread. No, oh, man. I'm going downstairs. <laughs> Scary ass. Yeah, I'm gonna come down here to the door. What? Try crack then. That shit less addictive than um, cigarettes. All right, bro, bro. Just let me let me just ask you one question. What? What is one hit gonna do to you of my blood? Come on, man. Since you ain't gonna do cigarettes, you ain't got nothing in your body. You a, you a sober nigga, just hit this bitch. One time. I don't smoke no weed, bro. Come on, move, tell them. Not good for hit you. that bitch one time. I mean, it's either hit that or I get the needle. <laughs> Come on, why is you? <laughs> yeah, man. For real? Hold that, hold that, dang hard. I can't do it on camera, though. No, I didn't even hit it. Hold up. Yeah, you made this shit loose as hell. <laughs> Wait, how you know about rolling it? Oh, you hit that damn. You did a cigarette move with that bitch. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah his mouth turned to the side. Yeah. <laughs> hey, don't see it. Yep, I'm gonna turn into. Oh, you hit that bitch. <laughs> <laughs> hey, okay. man. If you start tripping, I'm gonna try to call me. I already got your number blocked, nigga. <laughs> Have fun. No. <laughs> I'm want, good. Want no, man. Okay, okay. Yeah. Alright. Let me know if you want that needle. That should help. <laughs> Something wrong, man. <laughs> <laughs> Put a shirt on, man. That's what yeah. I was thinking the whole time. Freaky. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> I know there's Cheeto video and shit, but me and his cameraman have been sitting here talking for about 30, 40 minutes, trying to let the nigga rock out, but we ain't gonna let him sleep all this. Look, please. I let this nigga have one hit though, and now he's sleeping. <laughs> oh my god! Like, come on, bro. That's, you know, try. Wake up, nigga. Wake up. No, I'm nigga, you up. is not that high. No. Oh no! <laughs> I'm for the dean is to get the fuck out of this nigga house, nigga. I'm like security. Wake your ass Stop, up, nigga. Man. Get your high ass up. Wake your. What are you doing? Wake your ass up and get out this nigga crib, your high ass. Go home and go sleep. I ain't mean to wake you up like that, cuz nigga would've hit me with a pillow. Don't ever think to do that to me if I'm too high. Cuz my high legs will bleed, walk out my body, and a demon will walk in. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Like, I'll wake up Freddy Krueger time. <laughs> this mother walk, the walls will start melting this shit. I'm so tired. You know what I just thought about? The guy at the Ray-Ban store, or the sunglass store, probably mad as hell he didn't buy anything. <laughs>